Welcome to Academic Game Tutorials. In this video, we will look into the differences between flat belt drive and V-belt drive. A flat belt has rectangular cross section where a width is significantly larger than thickness. It usages a cylindrical pulley where bottom surface of the belt comes in contact with the outer surface of the pulley. On the other hand, V-belt has trapezoidal cross section with width comparable to height. It employs a pulley having corresponding V-grove to accommodate the V-belt. Both the side surfaces of the belt remains in contact with the pulley. The flat belt is a jointed belt, whereas V-belt is jointless. So, let's look into the basic differences between flat belt drive and V-belt drive in a tabular form. Difference number 1. Flat belts have a rectangular cross section, where width of belt is much larger than thickness, whereas, V-belts have a trapezoidal cross section, where maximum width is almost same with the thickness. Number 2. The pulleys for flat belt drive are simple in construction and thus cheaper, whereas, in V-belt drive, pulleys must contain V-slot to accommodate V-belts. Slot angles must match with that of the belt, otherwise power transmission capability will reduce. Thus these pulleys are costlier. Number 3. In flat belt drive, only one surface of the belt remains in contact with the pulley, whereas, in case of V-belt drive, two inclined surfaces continuously remain in contact with the pulley. Number 4. In flat belt drive, wide range of velocity ratio can be obtained by utilizing stepped pulleys of different diameters and easily shifting belt from one pulley to another, whereas, such shifting provision does not exist in V-belt drive. Number 5. In flat belt drive, flat belts can be used for transmitting power to a long center distance, even up to 15 meters, whereas, V-belt drive is suitable for power transmission in short center distance, usually below 1 meter. Number 6. Flat belt drive can be used either in open configuration or in crossed configuration, whereas, V-belt is always used in open configuration. Number 7. Efficiency of the flat belt drive is comparatively higher, whereas, efficiency of the V-belt drive is low. Number 8. Power transmitting capability of flat belt drive is low, whereas, V-belt drive can transmit comparatively higher power because of the increased friction force due to wedge action. Number 9. Flat belt drive is suitable when velocity ratio is up to 4 is to 1, whereas, higher velocity ratio, up to 7 is to 1, can be obtained by V-belt drive. Number 10. Slip occurs frequently in flat belt drive. Thus is not a positive drive, whereas, due to higher friction force for wedge action, slip does not occur at low speed in V-belt drive. However, if load exceeds the rated capacity, then slip may occur. Number 11. Flat belts are jointed, or hinged, so their operation is noisy, whereas, V-belts are endless, so their operation is quiet. Number 12. Flat belt drives are usually suitable for horizontal power transmission, whereas, V-belt drives are preferred for transmitting power in any direction, even when belt is vertical. Number 13. Flat belts are also relatively cheaper, whereas, V-belts are costlier. And, difference number 14. Flat belts are commonly used in belt conveyor, sawmills, food industries, etc., whereas, V-belts are commonly used in electric pumps, compressors, machine tools, etc.